Edna May. You have this bright, wispy, blonde hair and the brightest blue eyes that there ever were. And her spirit was just something that was just so special to our family. It was a gorgeous summer day before school started. Our family decided to spend the day in the pool. I was the first to get out with Edna May and lay her down for a nap. I went to the grocery store, and when I got back, she had gotten up from her nap. She was wearing a white dress with colorful polka dots. It was one of her favorites. I got her all settled into the glider chair, and I started putting my groceries away. I get called into the other room, and I came back, and she wasn't where I had left her. I proceeded to go bedroom to bedroom throughout the house looking for her before I went outside. That's when I found Em floating in our backyard pool, and our world just came to an end. When we were first brought to the hospital, we felt like we were alone. Like we were the first family that this happened to. And we soon found out that this was so common, that drowning is the number one cause of death. When I think about M's incident and when I think about the statistics that are surrounding it, I was so naive. Always check the water first. Who would have ever thought she would have went right to the pool? She was taken from us. If we would have only known, there could have been layers of protection. 